Why? Why are Brian and I stupid, Perlita? Hey, Bernard, what? Because we're giving giving the police and the military and some of those guys something a little bit back after it was like decimated by the groups of you fighting over them girls that you guys said you guys didn't love at first, but now all of a sudden you do. Is that why Brian and I are stupid and my dad's stupid, huh, Perlita? Because some of us believed in something, Perlita, but we'll never get to see that again. And what parts of it we did get to, it didn't last that long. So how am I, how me and Brian stupid? After what they've got to go through in the last, who knows, 14, 15 years, it's the least we should be able to do for them, for the police officers and the military, because they have to work all the fucking time. And most of you get the free ride. Like I said, if the world was a little bit on the other side of that, it would be beneficial to both. But you guys run a torture chamber multiple times, Perlita, with Bernard and his carny, and you guys lie about it, took stuff, ripped out whole realities that took work, and that guy's whole life is centered around trying to destroy me. And every time he's done it, it just gets worse because they've lied. So I know he's going to kill me anyway because that's what they did before. So might as well just help the police and the firefighters and all them and the military get a little bit back because, you know, that's all they got. You are the ones, Robo Knight and 61 Amphibious Base Man. Who else? The ones tearing, or tearing up the Hollywood celebrities. You're the ones that mocked it ever in and all you guys. Now you guys want it back after everybody's all beast and sick and jacked up. Don't tell me it wasn't there when we all know it was. So, stupid. Me and Brian? No, because me and Brian are pretty much jacked up. So is my dad and some of those other guys. So the least we could do, since we're going to have to pass away anyway, is give it some of it back to the military and police and firefighters and help them get it to go. And uh, anybody else. That's all we can do. I'm not the one people open and thought it was funny to do all that nasty shit. Joe violated me and my friends who knew what they were doing. You adults didn't want to give the children a chance to build it. So, that's all I got. You jacked up my face, my eyes, I can't do shit. That's fucking why it don't work. So you guys who do that live in denial and... <coughs> Experimentate during crack. You're, it's you guys' sicko joke. It's self-centered. So if you didn't have it, you guys would have a different reality. You probably wouldn't even gone to war over the stuff out here. But hindsight 2020. So I just think Perlita and Bernard and the bit of bat for Carney swap around because they're jealous. Because they're getting it to work an older way. And there was a reality a long time ago. If that was me alive, that I would have wanted to be a part of, that I wasn't allowed to because you guys took advantage of me and my friends trying to evolve you guys to see that. But we can't see you. Well, we got to see the ones of the Destructo team. And well, it stank. That's why I say no ghetto life, please. No country and western. No carny, but they let Team Spoil have it. And like I said, DOD 101. They're going to teach you, Perlita, here in the East Coast, West Coast, because you keep asking the question, wait, 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 wait. They're going to teach you why your process doesn't work. Because I won't be here, but it'll take a lot of work to get you guys back to what was never yours in the first place. Get it, Perlita? Dave, Robotai, don't let you, but it'll be under a thumb. So, you know. Don't sit there and call people stupid, Perlita, when you don't have all the history of an area or a state. You guys just went ghetto banging. And that's always been the problem out here. That's why I came back, because I paid attention to some things my parents said and some other people said to see if the theory was correct. So you guys won't know that reality, because those of you who moved in through, through certain decades didn't respect it. And those people leave, like the Jews or the Russians. Or the Japanese, that you, you're more the bitten that are left here that you guys destroy. So, you know, you won't get to know the reality of those people because, you know, you guys kill them. And well, Bernard, 
that's fucking stupid because they're some of the ones that built the reality that you all destroyed. 